second. Penta thinks he's won it. Does Ricky say what? Ladies and gentlemen, the winner of this match and advancing to the semi-final on Saturday, Ricochet! in this whole World Cup. unstoppable so far and even someone who knows him as well as Will Ospreay does I'm not sure on this night can beat that man well we sat at ringside Dave Bradshaw and watched as King Ricochet defeated the monstrous man Keith Lee in the qualifiers I never thought that was possible I have learned that nothing is impossible when it comes to King Ricochet speaking of which trying to finish it early. Wow. Ricochet and Osprey going at it again, picking up where they left off. Both men landing on their feet. A real standoff, almost immortal combat between Osprey and Ricochet. It's a thing of beauty when these two men collide. What an exchange to start things out between Osprey and Ricochet. Shoulder block, nip up, ricochet. So hard to catch, but Osprey, the same is true of him as well. Again, they charge at each other. Osprey handspring caught by Ricochet, who knows Osprey's every move. Got his shoulders down for a power bomb and a two count early on for Ricochet. Osprey looking to end this one early with the odds cutter. Ricochet! Oh, torpedo into the chest of Will Ospreay. Both of these men looking to end this one early. Now that's back to what we said during the previous semi-final, Bradshaw. It's all about getting the job done as quickly as you can because both Ricochet and Will Ospreay could potentially have two matches here tonight in Newcastle. 
Yeah, that's a great point. And also by luck of the draw, there uh, on second here is Ricochet. Goes for a suplex, perhaps, or a brain buster. What is this? A brain buster oh. on the hard staging oh. on Osprey. We didn't see that in Japan. Every time Ricochet and Will Osprey come together, they offer something new. That is what makes this combination so, so special. And what I was about to say a minute ago before that happened was that by luck of the draw, obviously Osprey and Ricochet are on second here. And so Kushida is going to have those valuable extra minutes to recuperate ahead of whichever one of these two gentlemen he's going to face in the final. Yeah, absolutely spot on. Great point. Less time for the winner of Osprey versus Ricochet to recuperate, recover, and time for that massive, massive final. Osprey looks as though he's not going to recover from that brain buster on the stage. Well, this may be it over very early, and that would suit Ricochet just fine. He'll happily take this by count out. Well, think about this, Bradshaw. We, we are seconds away yeah, from to, having. We're up to count of seven now, eight. From having no Englishman left. In the Pro Wrestling World Cup. That's, yeah, that's a great point from two down to zero. Here comes Ricochet! Ricochet launching onto Osprey. That resets the count. Doesn't matter, they're both in. Ricochet, springboard, 450, cover to go to the final. Osprey kicks out, and we are still alive here. The King is showing why he is widely considered wrestling royalty. But the Earl Assassin, Will Osprey, one of the best wrestlers on planet Earth today. We've said that time and time again, but he looks rattled. Ricochet scrambled Osprey's brains on that stage. It's going to take something for the Aerial Assassin to get back into this semi-final. We've already mentioned both Osprey and Kushida's victories in the Best of the Super Juniors. Ricochet's also won it in 2014, a year in which he also won the Battle of Los Angeles over in Pro Wrestling Guerrilla. Look, King Ricochet full of confidence. Big chop across the chest of Osprey from Ricochet. Hurt the hand of Ricochet, but he doesn't look as though he cares. A little nature boy action. Yeah, channeling the great Ric Flair. Get well soon, Rick. Get well soon, Will Osprey, if these chops continue. And Ricochet with Osprey on his back now. Trying to stretch out Will Osprey. He can do some damage to that lower back. Oh, no. He can really put the brakes onto Osprey's offense. And Ricochet looks so calm, so collected, so composed in the early reach. He's blowing a kiss at the fans around the world watching him systematically take apart Will Osprey. That's been a theme in this World Cup, Dave Bradshaw. You can hear they are right down the middle again, just as they were in the previous semi-final. Half of this arena in Newcastle upon time supporting Osprey. Half supporting Ricochet. Ricochet goes to the ropes. I think Osprey was looking for a hip toss. A counter and a clothesline from Ricochet. Ricochet will not be denied here tonight in Newcastle. This this is a real, real confident athlete we're seeing. I'm telling you, and I don't I'm not saying it with any glee because I'm an Englishman and I hope Osprey goes through, but I'm telling you, Ricochet, he's been my pick, I'm sticking there. Ricochet, I just feel like it's his year. Even as a Scotsman, Bradshaw, all my options for my countrymen are gone at this point. But uh, both these men, you, you can't help but admire them. Let's just say that. Ricochet stomping on the back of the neck there of Osprey. As he uh, continues to press his advantage in this one. And think about this as well, Dave Bradshaw. This is almost a hidden element to this match. Think about what happened to Will Osprey back at Stacked. Yeah, that was just a few days ago. But what was it, Tuesday night? Oh my God, look at that! The heel into the head. You heard the skull cracking, it sounded like, of Osprey. Ricochet with some pure aggression there towards the aerial assassin. Well, could that attack at the hands of the prestige at stack, could that be why Osprey came in here and tried to end this match with the odds cutter early? Is there an underlying injury that Osprey isn't telling anyone about? Uh, it may be that. It may be the fact that he just knows that Whenever he goes one-on-one -on -one with Ricochet, it's, it's such a, a coin toss, which of them's going to win? They're so evenly matched. But Osprey thought if he could surprise Ricochet, do something that he's never done against him before, maybe that would be enough. If 
unfortunately Ricochet had the same idea. 100% and Ricochet right now looks more successful. Ricochet, a discus elbow. And now he's going to send Osprey, well he was going to try and send Osprey to the outside. Osprey tried to counter with the handspring and Ricochet caught him with a drop kick. Superb for Bradshaw, it looks like no matter what Osprey... And for a quick cover there and that was a, uh, an unusually arrogant move from Ricochet. No matter what Osprey does, no matter which way he twists and turns, Ricochet looks to have the answers to him. Ricochet defeated Matt Seidel and Keith Lee in the American qualifiers and Helico in the round of 16 and as you saw Penta El Zero Miedo in a very close quarter final to get to these semis and he is now dominating this semi-final against his long-time rival Will Ospreay. Ospreay though, not done yet. Those forearms from Ospreay. Never say die from the assassin. Osprey clutching at his neck but feeling the energy of this mostly British crowd. Ricochet 619! Ricochet with a springboard, Osprey out of the way. Osprey again off the ropes, Osprey an overhead kick. Ricochet landing awkwardly on his head, maybe knocked out. Well, it sure looks like it. He came down hard on that head, did Ricochet. Well, Osprey though. He'll need more than that to come through this and advance to the final. Well, Very emotional young man. He needs to channel that emotion. Yeah, Will Ospreay beat Martin Kirby and Rampage in the English qualifiers. Beat his hero, Rey Mysterio, in an instant classic in the round of 16. And Mike Bailey in an equally good quarter final. A very memorable run in this Pro Wrestling World Cup for Ospreay. But is it about to end here at the hands of Ricochet? Not if he has anything to do with it. Ospreay. What a kick. With a roar of defiance as he unleashed that one into the body of Ricochet. Here he comes again, Osprey. Osprey with an uppercut and tripping the legs of Ricochet, who's down in the corner. Osprey will take a run up at Ricochet. Ricochet caught him! Oh, Ricochet, what a catch! What a catch from King Ricochet! Maybe Osprey was going to look for the Ben Driller instead. Ricochet trying to slam Osprey. Osprey reverse, Rana! And he dumped Ricochet on his head. And that's the second time in a matter of moments that Ricochet has came down hard on the top of his head. That could be very, very telling. Look at the eyes of Ricochet. He's uh, almost glazed over, it seems like. Zombified at this point. But as, as you say, after those two landings on his head, there's a possibility of a concussion. And if, if he's uh, losing his sense of balance or anything, it looks like he is, then Ricochet, a much less dangerous prospect than he would be otherwise. This could be a turning point for Will Ospreay. Ospreay will launch. Leaping forearm there. Everything also causing pain to shoot through the neck of Will Ospreay, even when he's on the offensive. He has to ignore that pain if he hopes to advance to the semi-finals. Ospreay. Advance to the finals from the semi-finals. Going to the Rain and Maker. That move that he learned from his friend and mentor, Kazushka Okada, in the Chaos Faction in New Japan. Ricochet countered, he's still holding onto the wrist, is Osprey, or at least he was! He just goes close line, takes Osprey down. And Osprey just looked like he was shot out of a cannon there. That, another brutal clothesline from Ricochet. Both men down, we have a count on here. You think of the emotion Dave Bradshaw and Milton Keynes for Will Osprey facing his idol, his hero, Rey Mysterio, and not only that, defeating him to advance from the round of 16, also beating Mike Bailey in another stunner. Osprey will have to do something similar here tonight in Newcastle against Ricochet. Well, Ricochet is first to his feet. Osprey still holding that neck, looking like he's in considerable discomfort. Interesting, he talked about Osprey's victory over his hero, Rey Mysterio. The Rey Mysterio is also a hero for Ricochet, who faced him Tuesday night at a stack. And unlike Osprey, Ricochet did not beat Mysterio. And I think that's probably eating away a little bit at Ricochet that Osprey managed to do what Ricochet did not. Oh, this is ominous. Hang on, Osprey. 
Tucking in the header, Ricochet. We know what he's trying for here. Ricochet, all caught up. Osprey goes for the cheeky Nando's kick. Ricochet moves. Kicks Osprey in the face. And sweeps the leg away. Oh god, long blow by Ricochet. He'll roll over the cover as quick as he can. Look at the left leg, wasn't enough. What? No, no, no. But again, Osprey grabbing at the neck, even kicking out of that pinfall cover from Ricochet. Hurt Will Osprey. Referee John Myers ruling that a two count, but it is the closest near fall so far of this semi final. Listen to this crowd in Newcastle fired up for the Pro Wrestling World Cup finals. Once again, split completely down the middle here. Fans from the United States have come over. A great many of them we've had the privilege of meeting all around the country during this World Cup week here. A considerable ricochet contingent in attendance tonight. Osprey putting on the brakes there. He, that, that, was, that was so crucial that he managed to do that. Ricochet could have finished this match. Ricochet. A knee into the gut there of Osprey. Second one. This is a part of Ricochet that people forget about. With all the high flying offense, he can strike and he can brawl as well. But Osprey also knows a thing or two in that department. He hits an Inseguri on Ricochet. Oh, God, look at that. Osprey catching Ricochet. Oh, he caught him right again. Again on the head. Again on the head. And did he know? Goodness me. What a flurry of offense from Will Osprey, but not enough to put away the king. I don't envy you on play by play, Bradshaw, having to call all these sequences between Will Osprey and Ricochet. It's so fast paced, and this is why this combination has made it to the semi final. Well, every time they meet, they invent new moves. It's remarkable how they manage to top every previous encounter. Every time they meet, it feels like sometimes with these two. Ricochet, now with the German suplex, holding on to the waist of Osprey. He's still holding on. Oh, God. Right on the back of the head that time. Real high angle on that second German suplex from Ricochet. Ricochet still holding on to Will Osprey. Osprey is almost a dead weight, you feel like, at this point. Osprey. A third German suplex. This one with the release. Sends Osprey halfway across the ring. Ricochet will try to finish it with the Benadriller. Goes to the roundhouse kick. Osprey oh. collapsed. I don't think Osprey dodged that. I think he collapsed. I think Ricochet recognizes that too. Ricochet believed he put everything he had into that kick. The Benadrilla nearly caught Osprey, but you're right, Bradshaw. Osprey just falling by happenstance out of harm's way. Ricochet now stalking Osprey. Oh, Ricochet taunting the English contingent here who will throw Osprey saying, I don't hear you anymore. As he realizes in his mind, I think he thinks this is over and he may be right because Osprey, look at Osprey, he can't oh. even sit up. He's like not even animated at this point. Oh, Osprey though. Spoke too soon. As long as he's still conscious, as long as he's got air in his lungs, Will Osprey and Ricochet will try and fight. They would fight forever if they could. Ricochet. Going for the Benadrilla, maybe. Oh, Osprey landed on his feet. But Ricochet will catch him. Drops him hard on the back of his head. Puts the leg and Ricochet. Yes, no, no. Ricochet at two and nine tenths against Osprey. What will it take from Ricochet? That's what's going through the American's mind right now. As the sole USA representative in this World Cup, he feels the weight, the burden of responsibility to represent his country. Well, of course, Osprey is now the sole English representative with Joseph Connors eliminated. As it swings both ways, you're right. Ricochet, another big kick into the head of Osprey. This is uh, getting a little uncomfortable to watch. Osprey is so unsteady here. Oh my God, stiff boots right to the side of Osprey's head. Ricochet is showing a bit of a, a bit of a 
It's a word I'm looking for here, Bradshaw. A bit of arrogance almost in this match. Well, I don't know if it's arrogance, but he's letting Will Ospreay know that every time you get up, I will kick you again. And again, and again, until you stay down. Oh, oh. Osprey needs to stay down. This is getting to be dangerous now for Will Osprey. Osprey counted! Oh my god! Osprey counted! Osprey counted! Osprey got it! Osprey got it! Osprey! Osprey! England are still in! England's Will Ospreay goes to the final to face Japan's Kushida! Well, that match was almost going to extra time. We've seen how that worked out for England in the past when it comes to the World Cup. Will Ospreay didn't care about that. Will Ospreay, if you're right, now in the Pro Wrestling World Cup final. How huge is that for the aerial assassin? Another epic encounter between King Ricochet and Will Ospreay, but Ospreay, as you see, takes the final spot in the World Cup final. Kushida and Will Ospreay, our main event, coming up a little bit later on, a repeat of the final of this year's Best of the Super Juniors. Kushida won that one. Can Ospreay get his revenge in the final of the Pro Wrestling World Cup?